cumpliendo nuestros deberes de Estado. Si tú eres casado, teniendo mucho a tu mujer, teniendo mucho a tus hijos, cuidándote por ellos, cuidándolos a ellos, trabajando en tu labor profesional con sentido de justicia, siendo generoso, cumpliendo, además de los deberes de justicia, los de la caridad, que es meter el corazón en las cosas terrenas. I met Saint Joseph Maria for the first time in April 1973. There was a conference, a conference organized in Rome for university and uh, college students. And um, I was asked whether I would be interested in going to this conference. So I listed myself for it. And so I attended the conference and while I was at Rome, I was able not only to see the Holy Father and attend his audiences, I was also able to go and uh, be at some get-togethers organized for some of the students attending. And that was in 1973. And I remember sitting there and uh, a bit in awe because I was before this man who uh, gave me the impression he was a very, very, very holy man, you know. Not just by the way he was speaking, the advices he was giving, but the way he carried himself. So I remember that as he was leaving, I felt strongly the need to be able to meet him and to say something to him. Then the person who was in charge of our group told us, look, I'll give you an idea. Why don't you all guys go? You Africans, you Kenyans, go and stay somewhere on the corridor where it's going to pass. And when he passes by, then you can call his attention. All right. That's what we did. So when I was in this corridor, then as he was passing, I tried my best to call his attention. There was no need for that. As soon as he saw us, you know, this group of African students, he came straight for us so excitedly. And he grabbed the two of us who were closest to him and immediately back on one of the photographers, photo, 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 and he was so excited, he was so happy. I was quite happy about that, actually. This is because he had such a soft spot for Africa. You know, he, he loved us so much, and he wanted to, to show that, that he loved us. St. Jesus Maria would always tell us that as far as he's concerned, you know, he has many types of children in Opus Dei. He has children who are professors, who are doctors, who are ministers, but he also has children who are manual workers. He has children who are housewives, who have a very good professional work, by the way. And he would always ask himself, of all this, which one would I regard as most closest to God, or the one who fulfills his spirit the best? And he would say, the one who does whatever he's doing, or whatever she's doing, with the greatest love. That is the one who, before God and before him, is the one who is fulfilling the spirit of the work according to the spirit of God.